Well, I've gone through your application and vetted your personal histories, and I'm afraid this isn't going to work out. What? Why not? Well, first of all, there's a question of Tammy Lynn's drug conviction. Hey, I did my community service. Yeah, besides, that was five years ago. She's clean. There's another issue, and honestly, it's the more serious one. I was reluctant to bring it up because it's a little awkward. Ted, in the eyes of the state, you are not a person. Wait, what? The state official I spoke to said that technically you are classified as property. I'm not a person? Not according to the government. I'm sorry. But that is so fucked up. Property? You know what, Teddy? Let's get out of here. Come on. <sighs> Look, you seem like good people. Be careful. What do you mean, be careful? The state official I spoke to made it sound like your status had gone under the radar for some time. Your adoption request may have raised some red flags. If they choose to investigate the issue, it may leave you quite vulnerable. Hey. I just got off work and I heard your message. Is that for real? Did they actually tell you that? Yeah, it's unbelievable. Property. What, they, they said I'm property. Hey, what does that even mean? Like you're a thing? What, like garbage or a piece of shit? Well, I mean, maybe more like a hammer or an orange, but yeah. No, what the hell do they know? It's just a word. They can't change your whole life just by calling you property. Bullshit. Better ask my ancestors. You know, one minute you in Africa washing your clothes in the river, titties out, you good. Then all of a sudden, you somewhere across the world fucking Thomas Jefferson. Wow, you make history come alive. Why the hell is this just coming up now? Well, I mean, I've never voted. I don't have a driver's license. I don't pay taxes. I mean, hell, this is the first job I ever had. Ted, can I see you for a moment? I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to let you go. What? Why? I've been busting my ass at this job for three years. I just got a call from the Labor Department. I can't legally keep you on as an employee because I've been informed that you're technically... Technically not a person. Yeah, Jesus Christ. I'm sorry, but as of today, you're fired. Dear Ted, your Chase Bank account has been terminated due to a lack of citizenship. Dear Ted, your Discover card has been revoked. Dear Ted, you are no longer a Papa Gino's rewards member. Fuck, that's a big one. This poor baby booty. It's always going to be empty. There's never going to be a little foot in here. I don't understand. We would have made such great parents. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Teddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's wrong? Look at this. Dear Ted, the state of Massachusetts regrets to inform you that due to an oversight regarding your legal status, your marriage to Tammy Lynn McCafferty is unrecognized by the state and therefore invalid and hereby annulled. Daddy, can they do this to us? Let me see that. This is a nightmare. You fucking believe that? No. This is insane. I mean, Tammy's the woman I love. You know, I never would even have tried to adopt a dog if I'd have known it was going to cause me this kind of shitstorm. Well, this whole thing is complete bullshit. Now, if you ask me, we got to fight it. What do you mean? I mean, we get a lawyer. Oh, my God, can we do that? Hell, yeah. You know what we do? We'll get a lawyer, and we'll sue the fucking government for your civil rights. Johnny, that's a great idea. Hey, hey, maybe we get one of them Harrison Ford lawyers who gets shot in the head and then turns all retarded and nice and goes, what we're doing is wrong. Yes. You know what? We get out there and we stick it to them good. We take that shit all the way up to Judge Judy if we have to. Yeah. But we don't know any lawyers. All our friends make sandwiches. No, we just Google Boston lawyers. Ah. Jesus, look at that black cock. <laughs> 